All the cars in one minute, the movie, because every actual car would take too long. Lightning's a hotshot Owen Wilson race car who goes, wow, and ka -chow. He's fast, but doesn't play well with others. On the way to the big race, he ends up damaging backwater town radiator springs, so he's ordered to work off his debt. There he meets Doc Mater, others, and learns the value of community and putting others before your own needs. He applies that lesson during the big race, and he decides to stay in radiator springs. Five years later, Lightning's an even bigger hotshot, and he's challenged to the World Grand Prix, so he and Larry the Cable Guy head to Tokyo. What follows is a silly comedy of errors where Mater is a globetrotting super spy, I don't know. The Grand Prix turns out to be an elaborate plot to make a fuel company look bad, uncovered by Mater and Lightning. Mater is knighted by the Queen of England car for some reason, and everyone acts like none of this ever happened, because because what? Six years later, Lightning's getting gross and old. A new hotshot racer, Jackson Storm, is burning up the tracks and also Lightning when he gets himself totaled. He goes back to training and adapting with the kids and their newfangled technology with their smartphones. Loud music, millennium items, and your Sony play. Doesn't work, so he enters a demolition derby. Well, that didn't work and was humiliating. He finds Doc's old trainer and tries some new old stuff to make up for his weaknesses. At the big race, he has a change of heart and lets his new old trainer, Cruz, take his place since she always wanted to be a racer and she wins using a combo of new old techniques. Both of them continue to race, but Lightning takes more of a backseat to train others. I only focused on Lightning's story, there are other characters, but I don't have time for 